All right, guys, welcome back to a um, special edition of Beetlejuice Videos. We are obviously here in a nice little studio slash back room of my house. Um, but this is more of a shout-out video because I went to the Loretta Lynn's Qualifier this weekend, and I got to meet a lot of you guys. Like, it was really freaking cool. I was just walking around, taking pictures. I mean, it, it, it was such a great time. Um... But this particular video is um, obviously a shout out with Hoosier Racing Tires and to the guy, Brett Newport. Okay, I'm going to go and put his uh, business card right up here on the corner of the screen and stuff so that way you guys can maybe get some information, uh, call him, talk with him personally about stuff like I did or whatever. But I got an on-the-spot interview with this man. I was at the racetrack, I was walking around, I seen everybody going over there, talking to him, and... Um, it was just, it was awesome. This man took time out of his day to talk with me so I can talk with you guys. I mean, obviously that's really cool. So, um, like I said, yeah, huge shout out to Brett Newport um, with Hoosier Racing Tires. Um, hands down, probably the coolest guy I've met at the racetrack, uh, business-wise. Um, but like I said, yeah, I got I got an on-the-spot interview or whatever. So, um it was the Saturday, um, well, it was a three-day event where it was a Friday, Saturday, Sunday. Um, me and my buddy went Saturday and Sunday because Friday was more or less for uh, campers, uh, setting everything up, vendors, getting all that stuff ready, whatever. So we showed up Saturday or whatever, and it was just, it was a nightmare, whatever. It was cold, windy, rainy, and of course, that's when I got the interview. So, I do apologize for all the audio mess-ups. I'm still working on all that. So, shout out for you guys that um, kind of stick with me, I guess, through this uh, learning process. So, but like I said, um, next clip you're going to see will be the actual interview that I got from this man at the racetrack. So, um, I mean, I hope you guys like it. Like I said, I apologize for all the the mess ups or whatever in the video or whatever, but it was an on the spot interview. He took time right out of his day. They're selling tires right out of their trailer, so um, enjoy. Alright guys, I'm here at uh, Bar to Bar, the Loretta Lynn Qualifier, and I happened to stumble across this Hoosier racing tire booth, and I got the, uh, the guy to sit down and actually give me a little sales pitch about his tires, and I thought I would post a video about it for you guys. So let's go up here and uh, let's talk to him. Hi, what's your name? My name is Brett. Brett? Yep. I'm up from a Hoosier Tire Great Plains and also Hoosier Tire Mid-Atlantic. We're the multi-state distributor for Hoosier Racing Tires. That's perfect. Great. And uh, what kind of tires you got here today? Yeah, so what we got on display, we have our 110 and our 120 wide 19 inch bead size Hoosier rear tires besides dirt bikes. And then we also have our 21 inch bead size. Uh, we have these available in two different compounds and then we have the rear table in three different compounds. Wow, that sounds like quite a uh, combination. Yeah, yeah, we take a lot of pride in our Hoosier Racing Tire. Um, a lot of people may not know, but Hoosier Racing Tire is the world's largest tire manufacturer for racing applications only. Uh, we Every single tire that we manufacture is made in the state of Indiana. And uh, everything that we compare, we are lighter than the competition. So those are three major important factors we're very proud of. Wow, and uh, actually, I mean, just sitting here standing and talking with you, I'm, I'm learning as well. And so I'm glad I can kind of share this information with you guys. And I'm glad I got a little information about this um now when we talk about weight savings here whatever because we are talking about rotational mass like this is rolling weight and what's the significant difference what is your what is your sig most significant difference between the weight of tires so with your tire being in a tie industry for many decades we take a lot of our technology that is in a drag racing dirt circle track and road racing market and we encompass it into our dirt track dirt bike market so there's a tremendous amount of r&d that goes in every single tire lots of uh, testing time and on top of that, every one of our managers back at Hoosier Racing Tire, they know exactly what the customer needs. We keep very, very tight, uh, tight conversations with our customers because at the end of the day, we want their first experience to be their best experience. Well, that sounds great, man. Well, I appreciate you talking with me here today. Um, and will you guys be out here tomorrow as well? Yeah, absolutely. We've been here for all three days. Um, we're very, uh, starting to get very in-depth in this world, and we love to see our guys uh, with podium finishes. And uh, at the end of the day, 
make a tar that's designed for champions. Well, all right, I appreciate it. All right, so um, like I said, I'm glad I could share that information with you guys. Like I, I was sitting here actually being stunned with just like I say, it's the weight difference because I'm actually a drag racer. You guys know that. So the the weight the weight matters, and so I mean, if that means anything to you guys, check these guys out. I'll link them down below, and um, we'll see you in the next video.